Welcome to the Aldous Burzen Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Sam Murray, joined now with Stevenson Men's Volleyball Head Coach Aldous Burzen. And Coach, two weeks into the season, you guys opened the, the season in California at the Slug Slam. And then last week played two, two top-ranked teams in Marymount and SUNY New Paltz. How would you rank your team's play thus far? Uh, as expected, um, I knew it would be tough um, playing uh, the California teams and uh, Marymount and New Paltz. Uh, New Paltz was ranked three, and we took them to five. Um, so I'm I'm okay where we are. I mean, we're two. We took two of the matches, lost four. Uh, but the way I look at it is, um, those out of conference matches are really tough, and that if we happen to win our our conference we'll, we're going to have those kind of tough matches so it's really good practice playing the best teams yeah and playing the best teams you have some freshmen who are starting for you and so i think that's kind of a good good step for them <laughs> nate reynolds logan smiley uh alex alex smiley sorry no 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 alex melbardis but logan smiley got you some some kills some offensive yeah. swings there Let's talk about their play yeah i'd say i have you know, I, I lost five seniors. I had five freshmen coming in, and they were just <laughs> tossed into the uh, fire, so to speak, against the best competition. So Lo Logan, um, he's kind of in a vul vulnerable uh, position, having to pass and hit uh, opposite Landon, who's very experienced. But Landon's been uh, giving him some pointers, and and Logan's been hanging. Uh, and uh, Alex uh, sets at times. You know, we're um, still, like in football, I like to have a, a one quarterback, but right now I have two with Jared, um, my junior setter, and Alex is a freshman setter. And then I have uh, Nate Reynolds, who's a local Baltimore uh, boy who's uh, just become a monster at the net, uh, middle blocking. Uh, that's a position I'm uh, that we've had some injuries. And so he's stepped right in there and is playing at, uh, a really nice level. As a matter of fact, he made the all-tournament team at the Slug Slam. And then uh, we also, also uh, Garrett, uh, opposite play, has started some and played some. And um, Andrew Duquette uh, from Massachusetts, he's been in some. So, young team. Yeah, well, what do you tell your team, too, after these tough matches, especially <laughs> against these ranked teams? I know the New Paltz game, you win the first two sets and eventually fall in yeah. five. How do you... How do you keep keep their heads up? Yeah, right. I'd say I practiced yesterday. They were all a little down because uh, their expectations. That it's hard for them to look long term. Um, they want to win right now and conquer everything, and which is good. You know, I like the enthusiasm, but with that comes you know kind of the downs where you know they're um, you know we have uh, lost our last four matches, but you know they've been against really good teams and we've taken sets. So I. I I reminded I remind them like I I've, I've been talking here that we have two goals and you know one is to win our this new MAC conference and get the automatic bid to the NCAA's and then with that automatic bid I don't want to be trounced right away you know in in the NCAA's I want them to see the level of that out of conference competition and so I, that's the way I'm looking at uh, we're hoping to be above 500 out of conference and right now we're Whatever, two and four, we need a couple more wins to even that one up. And we haven't started conference play yet. So um, there's a lot of uh, – and I see them p playing better in practice. So that that's what I look at is that day-to-day, -day, are they getting better? Yeah, well, you guys have an off weekend this weekend. So next week we'll talk about that, that Wilkes matchup to start conference play. Okay. All right, we'll I see you back here next week. <laughs> Thanks, Sam. <laughs> For Coach Aldis Burzens, I'm Sam Murray, and this has been the Aldis Burzens Show.